the shortening of the reins, Valerie, is something that should be able to be done truly in in two steps. You, you, you take the reins that are on this side, and then you gather the outside reins here, then you gather put this to here, you gather these reins here, done. It should be that. It can't be like, I gather this one, and then I gather that one. By the time you're halfway around the ring, you're still, you know, not even on the connection that you could ride ahead. The outside one first because you're using your seat and leg, and that pushes them through his first half one. Try on the already and look at the inside reins, like by uh, shortly holding them in, in that hand. Go. Half halt. Right rein. Same way as when you ask for Pia. Exactly. Good boy. Do your right rein a little bit more. Touch with the rights for a bit. Yes, boy. Yes, boy. You're a good horse. And now you show me collected canter. What's that with the right spur going up so much? Do it again. The right spur touched him an awful lot. It should be your left leg actually more to the canter. The right heel should be down one inch back and he knows to canter through the closed right fist. Otherwise, lights are turned on. It's the same thing as in the, the Piaf Passage. Don't go to the hard aid to make it simple thing. Otherwise, how hard is it going to be to make the other thing? You should shoot forward off the leg, even thinking to go. Good boy. All right. Good. 20 meter circle. Good boy. Mallory, you look great. Heels down. Good. Medium canner. Go. Okay, okay. So go with them and say good. He scooted forward. You got to be willing to accept that and be happy with it, right? All right, and collected. Good, and collect on the spot. Toward the pirouette canter, you should jump faster, faster. Hands quieter, close the right rein more, on the spot. On the spot doesn't mean not on the spot. Good boy, pat him, pat him, pat him, pat him. And forward, and half past left. 